How to add a list of records for the Jersey Biodiversity Centre. To begin with, once you are on our website, you will need to log in or create um, and register an account. If you're already logged in, it will come up with my account and log out in the top right hand corner. If you need to log in or need to register, there will be a button here that says log in slash register for you to click. Once you have logged in, we're going to click on enter data, which gives us a list of different ways we can add our biological records. And today I'm going to add a list of records because the species I have found are all from the same location on the same day. So I'm going to click add a list of records, which takes me to the survey page. Now this page is split into two. It's got what did you see and where was it? So we're going to start by clicking on the date which opens up a small calendar. And we select our date and it will automatically fill this box. Because I've registered for my account, my name automatically comes up here. However, if I'm entering records for somebody else, I need to change this to their name. I'm going to start by adding our species. It doesn't come up the first time. I'll go for a different Now we've got a new column here which says record type. I can add information here. So if I found a feather, whether I found the footprints, the animal was dead. There is lots of things that I can add for record type. If I found the feces or the hair of the animal. And then to add my second species, I click into the next box and just continue the same process. I've split these two up because I saw a male and a female and I want to record the sex of this animal, for this biological record. Once I've completed um, all the records that I've seen on the same site on a single day, I'm going to click next step in the right bottom hand corner and this takes me to my map. I need to have a location name so I'm going to put in the, ne the nearest flipway name for today. And then I can use this map by double clicking and zooming in on the location. As I get um, closer, I might want to change this to satellites. So I'm going to click this little cross and then the button for satellite. And I'm going to drop a pin down where I saw the animals. If I want to change this dot to a square for a grid reference, 
I need to click on this drop down list here, click island grid and it will change my grid reference. If I want to change it back, I just do exactly the same and go back to lat long. And as soon as I've dropped my dot in there, I don't need to worry about entering a spatial reference. However, you can use Google to find different locations. And this might be easier if you're using, trying to find the location by using the road names. And I will just copy and paste this and enter it in here. I've got some information about the habitat I can put in here using some drop down boxes. And I can put in an overall comment about maybe I've seen some interesting behaviours from the animal. When I'm ready, I click save. And then if everything's gone to plan, it says, thank you for submitting your records to the Jersey Biodiversity Centre in a green banner at the top of the page here. If something has gone wrong and I need to refill one of these boxes, it will come up with a red sign saying I need to change certain things on my form. So that's how you add a list of records for the same location on the same date, but if you've seen different species.